With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. So the question is two circular concentric loops which are R1 equals given to us 20 centimeter and R2 is given to us 30 centimeter are placed in a XY plane. As shown in the figure, the current I is 7 ampere is flowing through them. The magnetic moment of the loop system is basically current is constant which is 7 ampere in the both. Okay, we have to find the magnetic moment. So now we know that the magnetic moment is basically written as the magnetic moment is said to be I into A. I into A where A is what? A is area vector. Okay, now let's try to find the area vector for the both loops. For the A1 loop, it is said to be what? Pi R1 is square. Okay, and the direction basically area vector direction is always perpendicular to the plane. So, and here the current is anti clock, uh, here the current is basically in the clockwise direction. So, you can use the right hand thumb rule and you will get the area vector as in the minus of kk. Okay, similarly, we can find the area vector for the second loop, which is said to be pi r2 square, and this direction in the Current is basically in the anti-clockwise, so the direction is k cap, which is okay, which is k cap. Okay, it is positive one. This is the area vector a1 and a2. Now, uh, the total magnetic moment due to these two loops should be what? It should be m1 plus m2. Okay. Now, try to find out the m1 and m2. Here, the i will be common, and the areas are what? It is a1 or the a2. Okay, area vectors are A1 or A2. Now put the value of the I here. I is basically what? I is given to us 7. Okay, and the area vector which are what? Which are pi R1 square. Pi R1 square. Okay, here uh, basically uh, we have given that uh, the R1 is in the minus k cap direction. So here it should be minus, okay, plus pi R2 square. Okay, and the direction is basically k cap. Okay, we will take them all in the k cap direction. That's why here minus pi r1 is square. Okay, now try to solve this. Here pi can be common. So we can write that 7 multiply with pi. Pi is what it is 3.14. Okay, and multiply with here minus uh, here minus of r1 square. r1 is what? r1 is 20 centimeter and R2 is 30 centimeter means square of 20 plus square of 30 and the direction should be in the k cap. Understood my point. Okay. Now, uh, uh, sorry here. Basically, these are given to us in the centimeter. So, we have to convert it into the meters also. Okay. So, R1 which is 20 centimeter is uh, uh, R1 is basically what? R1 is 20 centimeters so it is said to be 2 meters 0.2 meters r2 is what it is 0.3 meters so here we can write 0.2 meters uh, square minus point uh, plus 0.3 meters square okay so here we can uh, write this in terms 7 into 3.14 let's take the let's say positive as it here and minus point to square okay now we can easily solve it and finally we will get our answer for the magnetic moment is it is the magnetic moment net magnetic moment due to both loop is 1.1 and the direction 1.1 uh, and the direction is what it is k cap a m square okay ampere meter square now let's check the options so here according to it 1.1 K cap ampere per meter square. This option is correct. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.